Hello everyone, this is Fantasy-esque and welcome back to Wolfland in Planet Zoo. When we left off in the previous episode, Lycan died after the death of his mate Needle over at the rival territory. The gate pack is no more, unfortunately. Now the next pack that is going to try and establish themselves there are obviously going to have a different name because I, I thought about repeating the same name for them but I kind of want to honor the fact that they were a separate group and a separate effort that we had to populate that area and that they died out. So it breaks my heart but yes Needle and Lycan they did not survive the move into the rival territory because of lack of food. Now, towards the end, we tried putting in sheep, but unfortunately, because of the Lycan River, they just kept killing all the sheep in the river, and then they couldn't feed from them, so they died from lack of energy and starvation, of course. But look at little Hades. The Trident Pack, meanwhile, over in Wolfland, is just growing and surviving and doing the best that they can. They are absolutely flourishing, actually. So it is very nice to see little Hades over here playing around. Is he chasing his mother? Is he chasing his mother? Yeah, look at them. Look at them. Now obviously the Jackson River is a lot bigger than the Lycan River and if you guys have no clue what I'm talking about, then I put a map of Wolfland and all the labeled areas in the previous episode. So if you want to go and check that out, it'll be super, super helpful. Um, but there we go. There we go. What I might do, um, probably not now, but I'm thinking later on, once we start having more of the area of Wolfland expand and more territories we have, I'll probably end up putting all the maps as they change in a Google document. So if you guys want, you can access that and see how things have changed what looks like what and all of those shenanigans but looks as though we're not going to be having our packs battle it out or anything because we don't have a pack in the rival territory which makes things sad but that also means that we are going to be pushing in more wolves into the trident pack so that we can have yet another fight and get someone moved into the rival territory rather than put two separate wolves in there by themselves i want wolves to be taken from this pack and put there. So, hello little boy. Hello Hades. Are you gonna play around a bit? I'll leave him be for a second. Also, I think Ember was really struggling. She might be okay now. Let's, let's go and check. How's Ember doing? Where is she? Ember? Oh, she seems to have eaten. She was really hungry, but they get better access to food than the other guys. So we have Ember, who is the alpha female Kelly, mother of Hades. And we have... Not Tile, but Sap is the alpha. Okay, I see. So Sap, are you the father of Hades? No, you haven't had any pups yet. Okay. Little Hades, who is your father? Probably don't have it here anymore. Yeah, darn it. I don't know who his father was, but Ember is the mother. I think one of the previous alphas. Not entirely sure who. But, okay, let's check how many wolves we have. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six. We need to put in two more wolves. Three more wolves. We need to put in three more wolves. Um, because we moved two wolves to the new territory and then one of them died before we have another fight breakout. So, that is exactly what I'm going to do. Let's get even more wolves. Excuse me, hold on a second. I will get there eventually. Arctic wolves, let's have a look. We want to introduce ones that have good genetic... Yep, okay, this is great. So, we're going to adopt this male. Um... Let's see, you are also fairly good, and we'll adopt one other male. Yep, sweet. Okay, so we've got three wolves that we're going to get moved in. Let's send to the zoo. I mean, not the zoo, this is supposed to be. Wolfland! Send to Wolfland. And I need to get them named as well. 
Now, I will say that um, I don't actually have names from you guys anymore. I went through the entire list that I compiled. So if you guys want to leave more, then feel free to do so. But we need to name these guys over here. Okay, this female. Let's see, what type of names do I want for her? What type of names? I will name her Kenzie. Kenzie. Um, this male here will be called... Um, oh jeez, I don't even know. I don't even flippin' know. And I have a call now, so I was looking on my phone, but now I cannot. Well, well that's fine. Hold on a second. So where is Kenzie? Kenzie's in transit. Um, yeah, Kenzie's in transit. The other two have been moved in, I think. Ah, oh, well. Okay. Um, maybe Kai? Kai? Um, or not. Shake. We'll name one Shake. Why not? Shake. That's a cool ass name, honestly. Instead of a title, we'll use it as a name. And this male over here, Kenzie's joined the pack. We will name him. Let's see. I need to think about it a little bit more. We've got really cool names though that you guys have given me. Um Karam? Karam? I don't know. Hmm. Corey. We'll name Corey. Corey! So we've got Kenzie, Shake, and Corey who have joined the new pack. Seth, what do you mean? You've always been part of this pack, you silly goose. Yeah, I don't know what Corey's doing. Corey's a bit confused. But we've got the new wolves who have been put in. There we go. They're kind of wandering around out here. Let's have a look. Is that Sap? Sap, is that you? Where'd you go, Sap? Where the hell did Sap go? I don't even know where Sap went. Yep, Shake has joined the pack. Where's our lovely, um... Okay, I've got wolves coming out. Ember, how you doing? How you doing, Ember? Look at how cool she looks. She looks so cool. She's looking. She's looking. How you doing, Ember? How you doing? Look at how badass she looks. Oh, is she fighting? Is she fighting? This is a fight! This is a flippin' fight! The alpha female is being challenged by who? Oh my goodness. Wow! Holy cow! This is so cool! I mean, it's scary, obviously. Ah, oh, it's so intense. So intense! <gasps> Did Ember lose? Ember, you lost against who? Oh my goodness, who did Ember lose against? Who was this? Who is this? Avery. Avery? Okay, guys, that's that's pretty much the rules. That is the rules. Ember was cast out of this pack. She's the alpha female. Yes, that's what it says. But just going by what I have done in the past and what I'm going to continue doing, she just lost a fight against Avery for whatever reason. And even though he's not a female, she's getting kicked out of the pack, so she's gonna have to take her cub. Actually, no, she won't be able to take a cub. She's gonna have to go to the, um, arrival territory. So I'm gonna make that move, guys, and I'll be right back. Oh, guys, I feel so sad. Look at Ember. She's not in the arrival territory. She's looking through the gloss. She's looking through the barrier to see the other side, where she's left her pup behind. Oh my goodness. Hades only had one relative, I think, which was um, a lovely girl over here. Um, and she was his mother. Well, is his mother, but she's on this side. And his father died, was a previous alpha, alpha male. So he is pretty much by himself now. I don't know how the, this would work in the wild, but I think by this point we've kind of worked out 
that not everything we're going to do here is going to be according to the wild because the game just doesn't make that possible. However, I'm assuming he's going to be taken care of by his pack while they find a new alpha female from within their ranks. And the little Ember over here, well, she's not that little anymore. How old is she? She's 12 years old. She's approaching Elisada. She's an adult at this point. She um, is a lone female currently, so she's not an alpha female yet because, well, we know that the alternative name for these alphas are breeding pairs. So it's not like they've got some hierarchy going on for no apparent reason, it's just breeding pairs. And because we don't have a male in this environment, I'm assuming that nobody has any breeding rights, so they're not pursuing that. But she will in a second. We need to choose a male for her to bring into this territory. And I guess her previous alpha is not going to be the one. It's not going to be... Was it Sap? Was Sap the alpha previously? This is Corey. Who was the alpha male? Avery's the one who chased her out. Oh, Peppermint! You know, this. I guess this is good for Peppermint because Peppermint is Jackson's granddaughter. So I think it's perfect that she's gone ahead and become the alpha female. And I don't know if she's going to be... That's another thing. Is she going to mate? Are they going to have another pup? Because, like, what's happening here? Oh, Burn? Was Burn always the alpha? She's about to mate! Okay! So even though we still have little Hades, now that we've taken his mother out, the new alpha female, she's expecting offspring! Due in August, she can go ahead and she can have her own pups. That's awesome! Okay, so Burn is the alpha male. Was he always the alpha male? I'm wondering. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, everyone's being nice to Hades so far. Look. Aww. He's playing with Peppermint. So just out of curiosity, I know the pups really follow their mothers. Um, at least that's what I've seen. But now that his mother's been removed, is he going to be following Peppermint around? He's playing with Peppermint just like he would with his mother, so not entirely sure. Also, let me know if Burn was the alpha male previously or if that's changed. I think he was. I'm not entirely sure. I thought he was Sap. I swear I thought Sap was the alpha male. Huh. Maybe there has been quite a big shift from what I expected. Okay, but that's seemingly going good. Now we need to find, um, not trading from this pack, we need to find a male who is mature enough. Yeah, that is so interesting. Sap was the alpha male, he was Ember's mate. But as soon as she got taken out and Peppermint became the alpha female, I guess she took on Burn as her mate? He became the alpha male? That is so interesting. That means Sap is also going to get moved. If that's the case, then I'm moving Sap with... Um, yeah, I'm moving him into the rival territory so he can be with Ember again. I thought the two would have to be, like, they would be separated because of the social dynamics in their groups, but I, I guess not. And that's awesome. I love it. Okay, is this... Is this Ember? I want to stick with her for a bit. Look at how orange everything looks. Looks like it's on fire. Something like that. Yeah, she's gonna head on to... Let's see. Uh, Pine Den? I think Aspen Den's on the other side. Are you gonna go to Pine Den? We'll see where she goes. Pine Den is the more popular choice just because it's the closest from where they enter the territory. But I am seriously hoping that this time, these wolves will survive and then they'll do better because both Sap and Ember have had experience leading a pack. Whereas Needle and Lycan, unfortunately, they did not. Also because of food reasons, but these guys also do have, um, I think they've got like four sheep in this area, in their territory. So even if the rangers don't come in with kills, at least they'll be able to do some hunting, and I'm hoping that at least one of those kills won't be in the Lycan River. That is the one way. I'm assuming if, see, if they hunt near Aspen Den, that's probably going to be a lot better for them. Because there's no water on that side, on that half of the rival territory, so it'll be easier for them to make sure that they can get food. 
Okay, she settled down in Pine Den. Let's go and check up on... What? Already? Peppermint? You're already about to have offspring? That is so quick, you literally just mated. Well, I won't, I won't complain. And you know what? We've always had just one pup. Have you guys noticed that? I don't know what it is, but all our wolves have had just single pups. Um, they've never really had a litter of wolves. Or a litter of, yeah. It's interesting. Is Peppermint going to change that? Is it the territory? I have no clue. She's chasing food, I think, right now. One of the rangers has come in with some food. They're about to lay down a carcass somewhere, so maybe she wants to eat before she gives birth. But I guess we'll go ahead and see. You know what? This is great because it means little Hades is going to have playmates. Which should be fun for him. I haven't seen how young wolves interact with each other in the game just yet. So that'll be pretty fun, actually. That should be pretty fun for us to see them interact. Okay. That was not a kill they laid down, but I think she... They refilled something. Okay, about to have your pups. Are you about to have your pups, Peppermint? She had one pup! Oh, so cute! Let's see. <gasps> two, two pups! Oh my goodness, she had two pups. She had two pups! Oh my goodness! Okay, she had a male and two males! Hades, you have playmates! You have playmates, Hades! Okay, geez, they need names. Wow, I did not expect we'd need so much names in this episode. Okay, let me go ahead and see what type of names um, I can go ahead and give these boys. Who oh, looks so cute. Oh my goodness, so cute. Okay, I'll name this one Morgan. Morgan, welcome, welcome. And your brother, Morgan, is going to be called... Um... Let's see, Morgan, and what? Teddy, I'll name him Teddy. Teddy, Morgan and Teddy, welcome to the pack. That is awesome, that is awesome, I love this so much. Oh, that is so cute! We have three pups in this pack. It is truly doing well, honestly. And oh, now I'm also wondering, now that Ember is separated from her offspring, is she going to want to mate? Look, Sap's the alpha again, and I think that means Ember will have her status back as well as alpha female. Yeah, I'm wondering that is she going to want to mate now that, I mean, her pop has been removed from her? I'm actually not entirely sure how that's going to go down. But I certainly hope they have a good time. Hades is getting hungry. I hope he eats soon. Oh, he gets... Yeah, I think these... They should be okay. Look. We've got a kill laid down here. We've got a couple of kills. See, one here, another there that one of the pups are going to. So, I think they'll do pretty well over here. See, these guys, they don't have to hunt as much. At all, really. They get they get supported. Unlike the ones down here. They actually have to hunt. But anyways, guys, with that said and done, I'm going to leave off. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.